One person is dead tonight after police say a rail runner train packed with commuters crashed into a car. APD is trying to figure out how the car ended up on the tracks at Candelaria just east of 2nd Street. That's where we find News 13's Marissa Lucetto who spoke to passengers. Marissa. Dean, just this railroad crossing was closed for hours today and barely reopened about an hour ago. Uh, tonight, police are trying to figure out if the crossing gates came down in time or if the car ended up stuck in between them when it was hit. And we spoke to people on that train who are still shaken up. It was just sad. I mean, it was just very sad. It was horrible, especially when you look over and there's the car and she's there. A rail runner spokesperson says the 515 train headed from Santa Fe to Belen struck a car here at the Candelaria crossing in Albuquerque, killing the car's driver. APD and AFR responded to the scene that closed the crossing for hours, delaying the train that was carrying 91 people. According to the rail runner, it doesn't appear that the car crashed into the gates here at the crossing. As you can see, both are still intact, but police say they're trying to figure out to see how the car ended up on on the train tracks. Uh, these trains can go up to 79 miles an hour, but once they get into the city, they slow down to around 50. Even a train going 50 miles an hour uh, takes at least a quarter mile to a half mile to stop sometimes, and so it's Is there a way to... Tough. Around 9 tonight, our cameras caught police removing the car from the scene. It appears to be the silver sedan. You can see right there the front driver's side is smashed in. Now, this crash caused some major delays today, forcing Rail Runner to then bus some of its passengers to different trains at different stations. Now, Rail Runner says it does have cameras on its train, so they'll hand that over to police to help them determine what happened in this case. Back to you. All right, thank you, Marissa. Police have not ID'd the driver, but say there was only one person in the car.